Yep, that's right viewers, it's just after 5 o'clock in the morning and I couldn't sleep. I thought I might go out for a little walk, early morning walk, before the day begins, so let's go. The date today is the 24th of May 2020. It's been a breezy morning, I've got to keep it down because obviously everyone else is still asleep. Stupid door. There we go. Yeah, so I got to bed at like 11 last night and then I woke up at 3 and I couldn't get back to sleep again. And last night I had a pizza. My, uh, the pub that I used to work at before all this lockdown business started, they were open for takeaways and they had like a set menu for this weekend. So I decided to order a pizza from the pub that I used to work at. Hopefully everything should be back to normal soon. We'll see. How about that for a village name? Absolutely mental. So yeah, this is the village of Llamapachguingis on the Isle of Anglesey, North Wales. And it's a nice area. I've lived here all my life. It's usually very touristy during the summer, but as you can see, not at the moment. Like, there's usually loads of coaches parked over there. The outside, James Pringle Weavers. Some people doing work over there. So that electricity pylon is making a funny noise. Um, this might be the vlog. This might be the last vlog that I film with this camera. I'm currently filming using a Canon SX PowerShot 640IS, I think. And I've bought a new camera on Amazon. Or well, when I say new, it's a model that I had before, so it'll be less bulky than this one. Tuffin T. Gwyn. It's a nice pub. That's my street, Ford Pemmonith. My flat's just up there. My shop selling wedding dresses. There's a train coming. Okay, and to the left we have Tinlong Garage, the only Volvo dealer in North Wales which also bears the full name of the village, as you can see. It's recently been done up or modernised. Looks very nice inside. Quality cars for sale. Got all sorts. Recently had my car serviced and MOT'd there because all the Vauxhall dealers are shut. But I checked on Facebook recently and they've just reopened. Hopefully next year I can get it serviced at a proper Vauxhall dealer. No, I had my MOT done at Halfords. Silly me. God, I'm very hot in this puffer jacket. All right, we're now walking up a hill. My feet are knackered, and over there is the Marquess of Anglesey's Column. Used to be able to go up it in the olden days, but it shut many years ago because of the condition of the old wooden steps inside. But once you're up there, you get great views. Actually, before lockdown started, I was in London with my dad, and I went up the monuments to the Great Fire of London. It's sort of the same thing. Once you're up there, you get great views of London. I also went on the HMS Belfast. I went up inside Tower Bridge. So hopefully, if I ever do go back to London, make the most of it, do all sorts of attractions. One thing I would like to do is go to the Sea Life Place, opposite the London Eye. 
because obviously I watch a lot of Sidemen and one of their videos was they had to do some kind of bingo challenge where they look for different stuff one of them was a shark and they went to the sea life aquarium place Fam, I'm knackered. Right, we're now walking down Lon Revile. And over there, behind these trees. Here's my parents' house. That's where they live. Literally just up the road from me. I'm not gonna go up there, because everyone will be still asleep. Oh dear. So yeah, a lot of you will probably be asking, why haven't you done that job on the program 007 recently? I don't know why really. I feel like focusing more on this channel, because I'm hoping to grow it into a proper big channel. I might just do vlogs and that. The thing is, I've not been doing much on this channel either. Because you know, much to do is the when I get my new camera delivered I'll do another unboxing video my current speakers are on the brink of going too so I might order some more speakers and do another unboxing video might get a different set because I think I've had three sets of the current style that I've got now so yeah probably time for a change And here we are, home sweet home. Got about an hour and 15 minutes before the shop opens. So we'll just do nothing until then. Got the car parked up safely. I very stupidly decided to do this walk in very tight jeans and they've been chafing my legs off. Not very wise. I'm out of breath. I am not a very fit person, but anyway, that's it for this video folks, stay tuned for more and peace out.